Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are gonna be getting some cleaning done. We were having some family over for a day of pumpkin carving and hanging out and visiting. So I wanted to get the house picked up and smelling good, nice and clean before we had our family over. So we're gonna be getting some basic cleaning done today. So I hope you guys are ready for a little cleaning motivation. I also wanted to say thank you to Built Bar for sponsoring today's video. So you guys have heard me talk about Built Bar before in previous videos, but if this is your first time hearing about them, I'm going to tell you a little bit about them. These are my all-time favorite protein bars. They taste more like a candy bar than they do a protein bar. They are not the typical protein bar taste. A lot of protein bars that I've tried in the past have a very chalky taste and a weird aftertaste, and these definitely do not. They're made with 100% real chocolate, and there's so many great flavors. My current favorite flavors are the cookies and cream and the peanut butter brownie, but they're seriously all so good. The mint brownie is really good if you keep it in the fridge. It tastes like a thin mint. Same with the coconut. I just love all the flavors. There hasn't been one that I've tried that I don't like. I do have a discount code for you guys at all times. It is Kristen Casper 10 and that will save you 10% on any and all Built Bar orders. They do have different products as well, not just bars but these are my favorite protein bars, so definitely be sure to check the link in the description box. And now let's get on into getting my house cleaned up. Just starting off in my bedroom you can see our bedroom from the main living area we do have a pretty small house and we love how small and cozy it is but whenever we have people over they can see into all of our bedrooms so I do like to have all the beds made and all of the rooms picked up before we have guests over just because you can feel the whole clean vibe from the main living area when all the beds are made so I'm just getting my bed made and then there's some clean clothes here on my bed that Donnie had folded this morning. So I'm going to get all of those put away as well. had some shoes that were left out here in the bedroom on the floor so I'm gonna get those put away and then we're gonna head into Berkeley's room I'm gonna get her bed made and just tidy up in here a little bit and then vacuum Once I'm done in Berkeley's room, I'm going to move on to Braden and Brody's room. I am going to just get a few things put away that are out on their desk and tidy up in here just like I did in Berkeley's room. Just get things put back where they belong and then also get their beds made and vacuum.
this is a good a day as any to start the rebuilding of life. The roads that lay open are many. When the old one's gone under the knife, and I can feel the sun on my skin. Today I'm using the Mrs. Meyers Acorn Spice Multi-Surface Cleaner to wipe everything down. It smells so good and I love using a cleaner that smells really good before we have company. I also like to diffuse oils in all the diffusers throughout my whole house. Instead of burning candles, I do have a few candles during like fall and winter that I like to burn, but for the most part, I like to just diffuse oils. I love walking into somebody else's home and having it smell really good, so I always like to have my house smelling good, whether we're having people over or not. I just love a good smelling home. So you guys will always see all my diffusers going all the time. Some of my favorite things to diffuse is peppermint and thieves. I also like to do like pine and cedar wood and juniper, especially this time of year. It just is so cozy and warm smelling. Once I'm done in the kids' bedrooms, I am headed back out to the main living area. So I'm gonna wipe down the dining room table. We had done breakfast and the kids had been doing coloring and stuff at the dining room table. A lot of life happens at this table, so I wipe it down multiple times a day. But while I was doing that, I noticed this little floating shelf here in the dining room was pretty dusty. So I went ahead and dusted that off. And now I'm going to wipe down my buffet here in the dining room and then I'm going to go in the living room and just wipe down the tables and the TV stand, the tray on the ottoman and all of the surfaces in there. Oh God, here she comes. Too bad she'll never know Yeah, I can't tell her how I feel Because she has someone I'm also going to get all of the pillows and blankets put back where they need to go and just get the living room all straightened up Or at least I try to be Cause I hope that I'm not showing How I feel for 
Now headed into the kitchen, there was not a whole lot to do in here. The kids had done the dishes on this morning, and so all I had to do was wipe down the counters. So I'm just getting a new cleaning rag out, spraying that acorn spice on the countertops, and I'm gonna get all the countertops wiped down. Try to let her go Because she won't be mine I listen when she talks I watch her when she walks She's giving me these feelings That I've never felt before But she will never know That I love her so well She's with somebody else And I will have to let her go She will never know Like she stole my heart Without knowing she did once everything in the whole house is quickly wiped down, now it's time to vacuum. So I'm going to start in the kitchen since I just wiped the counters down in here. I'm going to just start in here and get the floors vacuumed. There's always so many crumbs and stuff all over the floor after I wipe down the counters. And then on top of that, just daily life. You know, we have a black lab and a cat and three kids and two adults. There's lots of pet hair and dirt that gets tracked in and dust and all of that. So I'm just going to get the whole house vacuum now the kids rooms are already vacuumed but all of the hard floors we're gonna do that now whole house is vacuumed so now it's time to head into the bathroom I'm gonna do a quick wipe down in here this is the kids bathroom but it's also the guest bathroom so whenever anybody comes over this is the bathroom that they're gonna be using so I definitely want it to be clean before they come over so I just sprayed down the toilet with some antibacterial cleaner I'm gonna let that sit there while I wipe down the mirror and then once I'm done with that I'll head back over and do a quick wipe down on the toilet there's nothing worse than going to someone's house and them having a dirty toilet 
it. So the inside of the bowl was clean. I had just done that a few days ago, but even if the outside doesn't look dirty, I just like to do a quick wipe down before I know we're gonna have guests over. So then when they go in there, it isn't dirty. The last thing that I'm gonna do is just pick up the bath mat and bath toys and close up the shower and get the towels out of there into the wash so it looks nice and clean in here. But that's gonna be it for this super quick cleaning video. I hope this gave you guys a little motivation and inspiration to get some cleaning done around your house, whether you have guests coming over or not. It's so nice to have a clean space to live in, but thank you guys so much for clicking on this video and taking time out of your day to watch. Hope you enjoyed. Be sure to subscribe if you are new, and I will see you guys in my next video very soon. Bye!